This video is brought to you by DistroKid, which means at some point I'll be talking about them in the video, so please watch till the end because their support allows me to keep making these videos. As always, a massive thank you to DistroKid for sponsoring. I know exactly what I want to do. A future base version of Clairvoyant by the story so far. Yo! That's... might take a minute. Let me see if I can come up with a chord progression that'll fit the vocal of the song. Once I figure that out, it'll all come together. That's G minor, right? Chat? I'm an idiot. I'm gonna transpose this as well. Uh, I'm not gonna do it in this key. I love how this is gonna go from Animal Crossing music to banger. Welcome to my life. I need sounds. I'm hearing a crazy, loudly 7-1 saw. Shorter though. It's gotta be, it can't. Yup, distortion. Ooh, let's put envelope on a filter too. Wanna see a cool trick? You know how if you wanna do super saws, to mix it is to pan one left, pan one right. Best way to do that is I'm going to make a group called Super Saws. I'm gonna rename this Hordes. I'm gonna duplicate two of them. I'm actually gonna turn off this serum here. We've duplicated both of the serums. I can turn one left, one right to delete all of those chords. I go from chords and then these go in. So now I have two instances of serum, both one pan left, one pan right. But my, my biggest issue with doing that was anytime I changed the chord, I would have to change both channels with the super saws on them. But now I have just one MIDI track with all of the chords on it. So if I make any changes, it'll go on both. And then for processing, I just do it on here on the saw channel. Freaking game changing boys. Need my poop saw. Give me a poop saw. You don't know what I'm talking about. It's just uh, literally <laughs> like, a, like a poop saw wave. OTT time. Okay. And we take this same poop saw, put it on the sub. Ooh, then we're flying. Uh, let's do the drums. I need like a big stompy kick. This kick is not hitting me quite where I want it to hit. Do be kind of weak though. We pick a different sample. Things are hidden. Combine them maybe. Woo! Kind of nice though. Let's get some freaking symbols and stuff in there. Now, you might be watching this and wondering how on God's green flat earth am I going to release a cover song like this? The legal stuff must be overwhelming. Well, fear not, because did you know that DistroKid allows you to upload cover songs on streaming services like Spotify, Apple Music, and more. Super easy too. Just upload it like you would any song. But when you get to this section, click yes. DistroKid is great because it looks after all the licensing involved with uploading covers and it's all done seamlessly through their regular uploads. Seems amazing, right? That's like a thousand dollars in legal fees, but nope. With DistroKid, it's only $12 a year to keep the licenses. Wow, amazing. Plus, if you use my VIP link, you get 7% off your first year of DistroKid. Links in the description. Of course, there are rules you gotta follow. Just take a look at this. I'm not talking remixes or samplings, I'm talking covers. Like the one I'm working on right now, where I'm about to record some original vocals. Just like this. Should I just mute the mic while I do the vocal? All fans off. I think you'll notice when things become different. Not me being the most prepared producer in the world. Is it getting the different takes? Oh, it is. Maybe I do that one more time. Don't paint me black when I used to be golden. I gotta get the lyrics. <laughs> well, I don't remember the second verse. Uh, I think my timing is all off there. Used no, why am I singing it like that? <laughs> Fuck. Vocals are hard, man. I used to be golden. Oh, that's so sick, that very last one. Maybe I get a better black. 
There we go. We'll experiment with some like different sounds. Oh, we can make this sound so sheltery. Or what if I put the drop in that key? G and D. Actually, that might not be bad. This G is not a bad note to be on. There's definitely worse notes to be on than G if you're on, you know, you're on the sub. I think this might be fine, honestly. Then I can keep my normal voice. Or what do we think, chat? Should we go with the nurture style voice or? I don't know the frick. I'm my brain is. I know what 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 freaking. That's what. There it is. I also want to make this lead way cooler. I listen to some former hero because that's kind of the vibe I'm going for. I might add some more distortion to the saws. Overdrive, maybe? It's a left-handed guitar and he's playing it upside down. That's freaking crazy. Because the freaking, the bottom string is the top string. Like how, what? Yo, this guy's insane, man. What the heck? Ugh, such a big fan. I need a crunchier sub bass. Because I have poop saw. We also need trap sub to balance it out. Definitely need this boy. I think some extra side chain wouldn't hurt. Give it give it that like real freaking this type. I'm gonna have to do this. It's kind of cool actually. I need a thicker bass. They ain't thick enough. I wonder if I literally make a dubstepy bass. It's actually not bad. Once I get this lead as well, it's gonna be crazy. I wonder if I add an arpeggiator to this or like an auto pan doing like really fast. I'll take that, that'll be the lead. Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> this sounds so bad. Okay, we're gonna find a different lead for this type. Aggressive. These are almost there. There's... Yo! That's... Yo! <laughs> That's it. Hey! Thanks for watching. If you like this video, if you learned something, please like and subscribe. It helps me out so much. Follow me on Twitch as well so you can watch the next one live. But other than that, I'll go make some bangers. Peace. I think you'll notice when things become different. The good vibes in our lives won't feel so consistent. And less becomes more cause the weight
Oh, it's a Valorant tournament on today. All right, I guess the uh, the stream's over, guys. I'm gonna be watching 